everybody, Paul here. Today I want to talk to you about what causes an engine to use oil, so stay tuned. You know, oil is the lifeblood of any engine. If the engine doesn't have oil, it'll be destroyed in seconds. That's why you still need to check the oil level in between oil changes, especially when using synthetics with longer oil change intervals, which could literally use up all the oil in some engines before the next oil change. So what causes an engine to use oil? The first thing is an engine leaking oil externally. The additives in engine oil today help keep the different seals and gaskets in the engine soft and pliable so they don't shrink and get hard. However, if the oil is left in the engine longer than what it's rated for, the seals and gaskets can shrink, become hard, and start leaking. This is commonly associated with sludge buildup as shown in this picture. This can also cause leaking with valve covers, timing chain covers, oil pan covers, and sometimes even an oil drain plug. What's especially at risk are things in the engine exposed to high pressure, such as oil pressure sensors, oil filters, crankshaft seals, and even head gaskets. If a positive crankcase ventilation valve fails, it can also cause major leakage issues with seals and gaskets. So if your engine's dripping oil, or you find oil stains on the pavement underneath your vehicle, then it's more than likely coming from one of those areas on your engine. The second thing that causes an engine to use oil is consuming oil internally. This can be due to worn piston rings, which allows oil to enter the combustion chamber and be burned. This is another reason why it's important to regularly change or clean your air filter. A dirty air filter will cause premature wear of the piston rings by allowing fine particles of dirt to enter the combustion chamber. Next are worn valve stems and worn hardened valve stem seals, which will also allow oil to enter the combustion chamber and be burned. Consuming enough oil on the inside of the engine can cause the catalytic converter to wear out prematurely. This is due to a rise in temperature from the oil being vaporized by the catalytic converter. If you've got blue colored smoke coming out of the tailpipe when you first start your vehicle up and before the catalytic converter warms up, then you probably have oil being consumed inside the engine. One big caveat to remember is once the engine oil goes beyond its rated service life, it'll be depleted of the additives put into the oil, which typically is six months to one year. Once that happens, the oil will break down and evaporate quicker, which will also cause oil loss. You also need to remember that all engines are different, and some engines just burn more oil than others due to engine design or even engine design defects. So the best way to avoid engine oil loss externally and internally is by simply changing your oil regularly before it gets dirty. And as I mentioned earlier, don't leave the oil in longer than its rated service life. It's that simple. So I hope this helps somebody out there. And if you like this video, please hit the like button below, share it with your friends, and please be sure to subscribe. God bless you and have a great day. Bye for now.